Hello, welcome to my Power BI lecture video. In this tutorial, I want to learn how to use the sum x and the related DAX function. Let's get started. Now, I have this particular data with four columns, and the name of the table is transaction. Okay, we can see the product and of course the unit. So, what we want to do is we want to use the sum x and the related function to pick the price for each of our product category and multiply that with the unit. Let's get started. So to do that, I'm going to come to the modeling tab and under the calculations group, click on new measure. So we actually want to create a DAX explicit measure. So I'm going to call the name of the heading column rather, total revenue equal sign so i'm going to use the sum x so the sum x will return the sum of an expression evaluated for each row in a table so it's an iterator not the sum that does aggregation so the first argument for my sum x is the table so the name of the table main table is transaction and of course the second argument is the expression so i'm going to use the related you know, function and I actually want to pick the price in our product category, then close my related, multiply by the transaction unit. So this is going to be on the row by row context. So I'm going to click on enter on my keyboard. And what this is going to do is going to multiply the prices, for example, for beverages times 21 units. So let's just apply the formatting, currency formatting. Right, so I'm going to apply Nigerian Naira. Okay, now let's go to our visualization and let's just create a quick uh, matrix visualization. All right, so I'm going to just drag. Okay, I'm going to use my product category or product name, whatever, and I'm going to you know drag the um, total revenue. DAX into the values axis. So let's quickly you know apply some formatting so that we can see it more clearly. So I'm gonna just come to the values and what I'm gonna do is to just increase the size let's take it to 20 and suspend it. Alright, so we can see that we've actually created the total revenue and the total you know revenue generated for Condiment, for example, is 15,680, which is absolutely correct. And the total revenue across all the product category is 75,237 Naira. Thank you for watching my video. Bye for now.